Hi everyone, happy Saturday. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020-2021 Panini Donner's Basketball 2 box uh, random team break number 10. One spot gets you two teams. All cards ship. A lot of great stuff here. These Marvels cards doing pretty well. So big thanks everybody here for giving this a go. Let's copy and paste your names again. Double it up. Double, double. There's all the teams are in. Let's roll it and randomize names and teams. Five and a one, six times each. One, two, three, four, five, and a one. Sixth and final time. After six, we got Anthony down to Wesley. Five and a one, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and a one, sixth and final time. We got Bucks down to Hawks. All right, so Anthony, you have the Bucks, Mike with the Trailblazers, Patrick with the Kings, Joseph with the Bulls, John Paul Watts with the Mavs. Patrick, you got my Lakers, Allen with the Wizards, John with the Jazz, Joseph with the Pacers, Fuad with the Pelicans, Justin with the Celtics, Mike with the Raptors, Fuad with the Pistons, Joseph with the Magic, Jeremy with the Sixers, Kevin with the Clippers, John with the Spurs, Mike with the Nuggets, Justin with the Knicks, Jeremy with the OKC Thunder, Mike with the Nets, Allen with the Golden State Warriors, Joseph with the Heat, Kevin with the Suns, Allen with the Rockets, Wes with the Grizz, Anthony with the Hornets, John with the Cavs, Allen with the T-Wolves, Wesley with the ATL. Let's get all this on one page. Let's sort by column B. All right, we're going to pause the video, see if there's any trades. And when we come back, we'll, we'll do those uh, two boxes right there. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back. No deals were done. It's all good here on Saturday the 6th. Thanks for spending uh, some of your Saturday with us. I appreciate that. All right, so let's pop open the first box. Let's see what we got. Got a little Duke at North Carolina action happening here. North Carolina already up 16 to 4 very early in the first half. Guess I have to start paying attention to college basketball, folks. Big tournament coming up. Anyone here actually watching this break live? That's in that's in this break that's watching live? I know there are people watching live already, but curious in, in this break. Maybe these packs really tough this year. Alright. Good luck, everyone. And once again, all cards ship. But we'll try to set aside as many of the, the sort of top players as possible. All right, there's second year Zion. And with a crunch time, I love these crunch time inserts. Anthony Johnson's present. There we go, Anthony. Good luck, man. Oh, he's got Charlotte, too. So he's, he's definitely intrigued about this break. All right, Pelicans, Fuad with the Pels. There's Denny Avija, Kongu. Avija could have a big, big second half. We 
We've got Kobe White to 49. Nice one for the Bulls, Joseph. Quickly's been looking pretty good. Sadiq Bey's been looking good. So there are a number of players that could have like nice, nice second halves of the season. Like Sadiq Bey's been showing showing some some moments, right? So is Emmanuel Quickly. You know, maybe they reset during the All Star break, and they could have strong second halves. Is what you want to see. Nice Steph Curry crunch time press proof. I'm sure these Doncic Marvels will do well as well. Joseph, yes, you are in this one. You've got the Bulls, randomized to you, Pacers, Magic, and I feel like you should have one more team, Heat. And Caleb Martin is our autograph out of the box, 35 out of 49, going to Anthony and the Charlotte Hornets. And we'll find his teammate in here too. Remember, break 11 is up on the site right now. This is two box break 10. Schedule's in the chat as well. Um, break 11 is going to be popped open from a fresh uh, case. 118 out of 199. That's KCP. It's Obi Toppin, rookies. Patrick Williams. Patrick Williams for the Bulls. Also showing some moments of brilliance. A lot of times it's just consistency. Some of these kids will go off for a game or two, but but then be anonymous for a game or two. It's a matter of who's going to have the consistency. That would be interesting to see. Obi Toppin will be in the slam dunk contest, which is at halftime this year. There's only like three guys in the dunk contest. I think there's Obi Toppin. I think Anthony Simons, I think, is another dude. And another guy that I, that I already forgot. There's Kenyon Martin Jr., Yes, that Kenyon Martin to 349. Tyrese Halliburton, rookies. Tyrese Halliburton, rated rookie, and James Weissman. James Weissman for Golden State. Allen with that one. Tyrese Halliburton playing good hoops. Patrick Colon. There he is again. This one's a press proof. You can tell by the gold foil, and it says press proof right there. Kenyon Martins to two to three forty nine, and of course LeBron James always sells pretty well. Got Belizia to 99. And to 349, we've got Matisse Teibel. I'm hearing, that we were talking about this, I think, yesterday or a couple days ago. I mean, will the Celtics make some, some trades? Especially now that Peyton Pritchard could look like a guy that could gobble up some more minutes or should deserve more minutes. Trading deadline for the NBA at the end of the month. I think it's going to be pretty interesting to see what happens. sure if my Lakers are going to be buyers. They may, be, they may get creative, but I don't think they have too much cap space, so I think they're going to have to get creative with how they add players to the team. So it's not always going to be too obvious on who they're going to pick up. But there's Peyton Pritchard again for Justin and the Celtics. Obi Toppin numbered this time to 349. 
for Justin and the Knicks. And there's Langston Galloway to 199. That'll be for Fuad and Detroit. Lakers need a little three-point shooting. They could use a little, a little more length up in the front court to stop some of the big dudes in the NBA. Jokic, Gobert, Embiid, etc. Carl Anthony Towns to 99. We got Lamelo Ball, the rookies, and a Marvels, Ja Morant, and Lamelo Ball again, rated rookie. There you go. All right, so there's the Morant Marvels. It's also a press proof Morant Marvels, going to Memphis, second year Ja Morant. But I'm hearing these Marvels cards are selling really well. Lamelo Ball, of course, for Charlotte, Anthony Johnson. Got randomized the Hornets. Each of these cards I know sell pretty well on the secondary market raw. And if you choose to get them graded out, it could be worth a lot. They grade out nicely if he continues to have the season he has. It would actually be kind of smart just to grade these now and, and just don't do any kind of rush on shipping. And by the time you get them back, the following season would have started. <laughs> and if he has a hot start to the next NBA season, to his second year, right, you'll have you'll have you'll have a PSA ten ready to go. And by then the value might be even more than it is now. Oh man, if 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 next year Charlotte makes the could could Charlotte make the playoffs this year? That would be good for the hobby. Here's Giannis Antetokounmpo, Jersey Kings. Yeah, Charlotte's a seventh seed. At 17 and eight, just a game under 500. I don't know if, I don't know. In the East, you, 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 can, you can get a spot. There's Anthony with the Bucks as well. So that would be hashtag good for the hobby. Bam out of buyer to 349 and Belizia again to 199. If um Yeah, if if we can see some Lamello ball in the playoffs, that could be that could be pretty interesting. There's crunch time John Morant. A couple other numbered cards here. And there's LeBron James marbles. There's Anthony Edwards. Number one overall pick, Minnesota Allen. The, uh, the, I feel like Minnesota's been a little disappointing, right? They're seven and, I mean, I guess that's why they fired the coach. They're seven and 29. There you go, Anthony. Nice. Him and his 12 year old are fired up about those, uh, LaMelo balls. Yeah, he's pretty good. Peter, group breaks are here. That's why it says case breaks right here. And on Instagram Live, yeah, thanks, Ben. But yeah, Minnesota's been a little, I know they've, I know D'Angelo Russell's been injured for a little bit. I think that has affected it, but I thought with D'Angelo Russell, with, you know, the veteran presence of Ricky Rubio, Anthony Edwards, Carl Anthony Towns, you know, and maybe some, some, maybe Jarrett Culver takes, you know, evolves a little bit. 
a Kogie takes it to the next level. You know, that kind of, I thought there would be a little more growth resulting in Minnesota being a great a, a potential playoff team, if not more. It just, it just, just, just hasn't worked out. And yeah, Towns was out with COVID for a long time. So yeah, I think it, it disrupted their, their season. But well, let, let's see how, uh, let's see how the second half of their season goes. And we can salvage some of that season. But Anthony Edwards has looked pretty, pretty good. Some signature dunks, maybe a game-winning shot, all within a, a week or so of each other. So. Uh, no, Peter, I won't. If you notice, if you look at the baseball, make sure you'll notice that there are multiple fillers that we need to do. Keep that filler information on hand. But if it sells out tonight, I'll do it. But we've got, we've got to chip away at some of the other fillers, though. Check out the schedule and check out the site. The schedule, if you scroll down a little bit, will have filler information. I'll tell you what, what side breaks we need to do to unlock the main break. There's Terry Rozier, 29 out of 99. There's Okongwu. Jeremy Anderson, been doing good. How are you? Adam, what's going on? How are you? Happy Saturday. Ooh, nice, Drew. Thanks for uh, thanks for giving those hit packs a shot. There's Emmanuel quickly. Nice, six out of twenty-five. He's been having a good season too. Some may argue he's probably been having a slightly better season than Obi Toppin, even though Toppin was drafted higher. I think Toppin still has the higher ceiling, but. Justin Gutting with the Knicks. Yeah, nice little color match too. I like the little blue matching up with the blue. The Knicks are Knicks could be a playoff team. Is that crazy to say? All right. So three forty nine. We've got Troy Brown Jr. Yeah, he needs a little more playing time, right? You think the Knicks make some deals? There's press proof. Uh, Cody Zeller to 190. Kind of hard to read the dark purple against that blue. Joel Embiid marvels. Zero gravity Zion. And Anthony Edwards, the rookies. So R.J. Barrett's been playing solid basketball. Julius Randle playing excellent basketball. And then rounded out with uh, with Alfred Payton, Quickly, Toppin, Nerlens Noel, you know, Derek Rose, right? So I wonder if the, if the Knicks... Make some, make some kind. I don't know what kind of move they can make, but make some sort of move. There's Sadiq Bay for Detroit. Fuad, here's quickly again. It'd be, be good to see the Knicks in the playoffs here. There's Dennis Smith Jr. to 349. Press proof. what the Knicks could add or what assets, future assets they have or don't have. Cap space, they must have decent cap space. There's Xavier Tillman to 99. Markin is to 349. 
But maybe they they try to strike while the iron's hot. Or maybe make a well, to make a blockbuster move. Maybe they make a little move just to say, hey, if we get into the playoff, let's see what happens. Be good. For, be hashtag good for the hot. Tyrese Halliburton, Kings, Patrick Cullum. I like I like his game. Precious chew up, getting some minutes here and there with the Heat. He's looked good. Isaac Okoro, Wiseman. Ooh, nice, Mr. T. Tyler. Yeah, we'll, we'll go through some orders. We'll get that on the schedule. Keep an eye on the schedule in the chat. You'll know exactly when that break happens once I go through orders and figure out where it lands. Second year, John Morant. Great for the Grizz. Wesley, LeBron James for the Lakers and for Patrick. Ooh, then we've got... Ivica Zubach to one to ninety nine for the Clippers, Kevin. And we got Steven Adams to two to three forty nine for OKC. That'll be for Jeremy. Another Weissman for Allen. Another Okoro for John and the Cavs. I think we're looking for him to, to really emerge, but Cleveland's been playing pretty well as well. Colin Sexton, Darius Garland. So I like seeing these, these sort of young players that we've been seeing over the last few years really start to emerge. Here's to 199. That's Marvin Bagley. Got a LeBron James, crunch time. James Weissman, the rookies. Zion, Marvels, press proof, John Morant. That's pretty nice. Nice press proofs. You can see the, the gold foil on the press proofs there. And second year Zion marvels. And that is for the Pelicans. That's for Fuad. I'm sure if last year's of any indication, the way Luke, second year Luka Doncic is selling, I'm sure second year Zion's should do pretty well. And even those second year drama rants too. We got Jersey Kings, rookie jersey, Isaiah Stewart. Pistons, that's for Fuad. And we got some gold here too. Anthony Simons. Three out of ten. I think he's I think he's my, my big underdog pick for the dunk contest. I think he's in the dunk contest. There's only three guys in the dunk contest. And I think he's the longest, he's the longest dog. So there's value there. There you go, Portland, Mike Krasinski. You're rooting for him too now. I don't know how much, I don't know what a dunk contest does to the value of cards, but could be interesting. Ooh, another LaMelo ball. Nice, another LaMelo for Anthony. One of these has got to be a PSA 10. There you go. Zion again. There's Oturu to 349. 
There's Steph Curry, Marvels. The Oturu is for the Clippers. That's going to go to Kevin. Devin Vassell's been showing some game. There's Obi Toppin. And there's Anthony Edwards at the end. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Another nice two boxes of Donruss basketball in the books. The next two boxes, which are in the store now, are going to be from a fresh case. I'm sure we can knock out another couple of boxes of that tonight. And there you go. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.